Hello, Internet. You are most likely getting ready for Black Friday, which is coming up. Um, I've been going through Amazon because we have a lot of early Black Friday deals. So I figured I would go through the best Black Friday deals that I've found so far for 3D printing stuff. Let's go ahead and get started. I don't know if this is necessarily a deal, nor can I exactly say if this is a good one. However, I did find a cheap filament that is a full kilogram here, and it's listed as being primrose green, and I thought this one was kind of funny. It looks like it might be a little bit sketchy, but I'm a little bit curious to try it out. Um, so this one is showing as being non-bubble, non-odor, and non-tangling. Uh, as well as being non-clogging, so all things that you definitely like. Um, some of the things on here just look a little bit off, but um, I'd still be interested in trying it out. It's showing primrose green as the color, but that aggressively and suspiciously looks yellow to me. But, if anybody's interested, it's only $9.99 for a kilogram, so not bad to check that out, I would say. So let's go ahead and get into the actual 3D printers. We've got the Cobra 2 Neo for just $159.99, and I've talked about the Cobra brand before. Um, they are pretty solid. solid. They are direct drive extruders and auto leveling. Uh, they come with a PEI build plate, so you can't go wrong with that. Um, and then I have seen some listings for this at this price with a time limit. If you, uh, if you click on the link that I put down below, um, you shouldn't have any problems with getting that. And I will have links for everything that I talk about this video in the description down below as well as the pinned comment. Moving right along, we've got the Voxlab Aquila, Aguila? I don't know if that's, that looks like a Q. Voxlab Aquila X3 3D printer. I haven't specifically had any Vox Labs myself, but I have heard from other people that they're decent um, it's only 159 bucks so realistically you can't go wrong with that for a brand new 3d printer um, it is auto leveling as well however I don't believe this one is direct drive so for me that's kind of a, a downside Okay, we've got the X2 upgraded for 149 So that's another option. Just discovered that myself. Cool. So moving right along, we've got the Ender 3v3 SE. Now what I did notice with this one is that it's not showing that it's on sale anymore. It was on sale previously, but if you look down here, there is a $22 coupon from the standard $219 price. So, not exactly a great sale. Um, keep your eyes open um, because I think over the next few days until we get to Black Friday, they're probably going to be having deals coming and going. Um, I did see this, I want to say, for $189 yesterday. So keep your eyes open, but also keep your eyes on the coupons right here um, because those, those sometimes are going to be the actual savings that you get. And then we go to the Soval SV06, which I do have a Soval. I have not gotten it to work properly, but that's one that I got from an auction. So this is another one here where it's $279 but they have the $80 coupon. And 
got more applicable promotions. Looks like they're trying to get you to bundle stuff together. Amazon likes to do that, so. Moving right along. We've got the Elegoo Neptune 3 Pro. I am looking at getting one of this because I hear great things about the Neptune line. Um, this one is at $199.49 for the Neptune 3, which is pretty solid. And then they've got the 3 and 4 over here. Now this is the Neptune 3 Pro, so usually that does mean some upgraded stuff. You can see here this one's the direct drive extruder and auto bed leveling. So those are two big things that you kind of want to look out for in most printers these days. Um, I personally do not want to get any more Bowden tube printers, even though this guy right here, my longer LK5, is a Bowden. That one still runs great. Whoopsie daisy. Come on, work with me here. There we go. And the Cobra 2 bundle. So this is just your standard Cobra 2. And it comes with some filament for $219.99. That's all I got to say about that. We've got another Ender 3 here. And you probably know I'm not huge on Enders, but I have people that swear by them. I personally wouldn't recommend them, but you've got a lot of people out there that say that these are the greatest things on sliced bread. Um, so this is the Ender 3 Max Neo. So this is going to be the larger print bed, and that goes back to the Bowden, um, Bowden 2, uh, but that does still have the CR Touch Auto Leveling. So half and half. Moving on to the Cobra 2 Pro. This one gets you $279.99. You get f the 500 millimeter a second high speed printing, um, which is, I want to say, double what the regular Cobra 2 has. And then you've got the auto leveling. Uh, upgraded PEI bed on this direct drive extruder. Again, you can't go wrong with that. And I do like the Anycubic uh, brand personally. And then we've got the Anycubic Cobra Plus. So we've got the Pro and the Plus here. Um, so this has all metal geared extruder and this one is just the original Cobra so I don't know this does have the 25 point auto leveling as well and is not direct drive I don't believe it looks like that one's a Bowden style so this one's a little bit older um, but it does have some upgrades to it And the Ender 5 is 355, which is down 39%. This one's going to give you the uh, Sprite Direct Drive Extruder, uh, CR Touch Auto Leveling, and 250 millimeters per second. And this one, the Cobra 2 Max, is going to give you your larger build plate, higher print speed, auto leveling, and direct drive extruder. And this gets you a 16 by 16 by 19 build plate, which is massive. That is huge. I really want to get one of those. And then we go to the Anchor Make M5C. That one's only 319 right now. Uh, so not a crazy huge discount on that. 
but that's still a good solid price. Um, again, I haven't worked with these, but I have seen a lot of people running great prints on them. Um, they're the quick speed. Uh, this one is um, 220, 220, 250, um, but it does not have a touch screen or anything like that. I wanna say you connect to it with your smartphone and then you just push the button right here in order to get that to print and then once you've got that loaded i think you can just keep pushing that and keep running prints again i haven't worked with it personally but that's what i've seen and then we've got the regular anchor make n5 which is down to 499.99 this one does have the full touch screen um and then that one's got the uh, the camera, auto leveling, all all that good stuff. And I've seen the videos that they put out with these. And they look super awesome. Uh, so that's another one that I am definitely interested in getting as well. If I missed any that uh, you've seen in the Black Friday deals, leave a comment down below. Let me know. Um, also, let me know if you are looking to pick up any one of these for Black Friday. I'm curious, uh, especially if it's one that I haven't used, if you end up picking up one of them, let me know how it works out for you, and I would love to get your feedback. And again, we're going to have the links to everything in the description and the comments down below. Leave us a like and subscribe to us and check out this video over here. Bye.